Breaking news, big announcement from the admin of the Artificial Aiming Forum. Just to follow up on the story that we put out yesterday about Artificial Aiming having a detection, we have actually been sent some screenshots of the forums of Artificial Aiming. This includes comments from people talking about how their accounts have been banned, numerous people that is, and then a follow up from the admin themselves of Artificial Aiming forums where they actually talk about what they believe the issue to be. And we're going to show you them right now. This is the first comment that we found. It says, we are effed boys, they got us, sheesh. This was in the forums of Artificial Aiming. This one says, I've just checked and I got a ban too. I was on earlier after the update with no problems. Also, all my other accounts have also been banned. In brackets, it says they have been shadow banned in the past because I rage hack and don't hide that fact. I have already got a fresh account ready to go and have ordered some more free SIM cards online to make some more accounts. Going to wipe trace files and run privacy tonight for a new day of hacking tomorrow. Regards. And this one says, got banned as well, was in the middle of a match, no unlocks, not even walls, just soft aimbot. This one's quite interesting, over 150 people viewing thousands of others from this site and others combined, let's face it, there's too many cheaters nowadays, they had to do something or watch the game and future games fail. Social media made hacks more mainstream which is good for the developers pockets, but bad for the guys trying to secretly cheat. If no one is allowed to cheat anymore from any site, I'd be okay with it. It's just gotten too rampant. Even as a hacker, I'm just amazed at how many cheaters I would run into every game. New accounts or old. Doesn't matter, every game had a few hackers. It's the main reason I signed up. Can't beat them, join them. I had auto headshot on only for when the team ran into a blatant hacker. I was surprised how many of you I had to put down. LOL. I will be very surprised and impressed if we are all hacking anytime soon. It feels like they got the message and used their money to stop it. We will see, I guess. I'm guessing we are all hardware banned now, so can't even play on a new account. And that comment was quite interesting. So the comments that we have just read out are from users of the artificial aiming software. These are people who have been banned because of the software they've had in use. A couple of different reasons, and one of the guys was even saying he'd be okay if there was no cheaters anymore. The only reason he joined was because of the simple fact that if you can't beat them, join them. Which we have heard numerous times along this journey. But the main comment from the forums that we want to show you today is actually from one of the admin. Let's take a look at that now. This comment is from an artificial aiming admin. As you probably noticed, we are experiencing a ban wave. I disabled the COD Modern Warfare Warzone hack, but I have a feeling it's our build-in spoofer that is currently detected, not the cheat itself. So I would advise everybody not to load the kernel protection shield button until further notice. I'm working on it, but I have no ETA on when this will be fixed. Greetings, Helios. So as we heard from the comments, many people are being banned. There are plenty more in the forums talking about their accounts being banned. But the main thing we want to focus on is the comments from the admin. The admin has spoken out and stated that they don't believe the actual cheat software has been detected. They believe it's to do with the spoofer, which would make sense considering quite a lot of the recent ban waves that have been done by Activision have been down to detection of the hardware ID spoofers being used by these cheat providers. So maybe that's the case and we will only find out in the future and as of late it appears that Activision are actually putting more things in place to cause a little bit more of a problem for these cheap developers to try and get around the detection. It happened recently with Engine Onin and it actually took them a couple of days to actually bypass the detection. However, they were back up and running recently, but with artificial aiming being detected, we can only hope that it's the cheat software itself rather than the spoofer, because spoofers can be changed and swapped and edited very easy compared to the actual cheat software itself. So like I said yesterday, we will keep you up to date, but if you want to get more frequent updates, follow me on Twitter at BadBoyBeeman, because I will be posting updates on there of any information I find out as it comes in. Triple B, over and out.